Hello, everyone. Welcome to the Forza 2020 Summer Fiesta. I'm Rarity, and I'll be commentating for Heat 2 of the Formula 1 race day. We're here in the fabulous land of Belgium to race here at Circuit de Spa Franco Champs. In the last race at Monza, the drivers who finished from first to last are Lewis Hamilton, Fernando Alonso, Connor Ross, Rainbow Dash, and Sebastian Vettel. Let's see who will take the win in today's race at Spa. And the races are off. Let's go racing. Here they come into the first turn. Plus source. This is a heartbreaking turn, so drivers have to be very careful on this turn. Here comes Rainbow Dash about to take on the road and Raddy on. Rainbow Dash goes a little wide on Raddy on. Rainbow Dash blasts through the camo straight as the other drivers are trying to keep up with her. Sebastian Vettel trying to keep up with Rainbow Dash. This isn't the first time Rainbow Dash raced on this track. In fact, she loves Spock. Well, of course she loves this track. Your car messages you while you go through these corners at high speeds. Rainbow Dash is also a five-time champion of Equestria Motorsports, with a winning a race in the Forza 2018 Finals. Wonderful driving by Rainbow Dash's Sebastian Vettel, and Fernando Alonso chases her down. And Fernando Alonso goes a little wild. Oh, would you look at this? This is the same camera angle Fluttershy crashed into in the finals. Sebastian Vettel and Fernando Alonso are trying to keep pace with Rainbow Dash. She's trying her best to get them out of her sight. Wonderful driving. Here they come approaching Ratchet. Rainbow Dash went really quick over on turn 18. Looked like she was gonna do a sonic ring boom on that turn as the drivers enter the final two turns to enter the second lap. Here they come to enter lap two. Current standings are Rainbow Dash in first, Sebastian Vettel second, Connor for third, Fernando Alonso in fourth, and Lewis Hamilton in dead last. Vettel went a little swarthy over there as they now enter a road and ride on for the second time. Interestingly, Sebastian Vettel did race against Rainbow Dash back at Barcelona. In an interview with the press right before the semi-finals, Rainbow Dash did say that Sebastian is a fierce racer. She also said that racing against him isn't easy, and indeed it's going to be guys like me. Sebastian Vettel is still keeping pace with Rainbow Dash. Connor also joins in to try to chase down Rainbow Dash. These drivers need to do their best on beating the fastest racer of Equestria. Here they come once again into Fulham. Amazing driving by these three. Connor Russ drives for his Team UK winnings driving that blue Aston Martin. He has won a couple of championships before Equestria Motorsports existed. So Connor himself does have some history. Sebastian Vettel is trying to keep up with Rainbow Dash. She's just leaving him in the dust. Outstanding driving. Fun fact! Rainbow Dash's Formula 1 car is the same model car that former racing driver Elaine Frost drove back in the 90s. It was an iconic race car as it was part of the Frost and Senna rivalry. Sebastian Vettel and Connor Ross still trying to keep up with Rainbow Dash as the three now approach the Blanchiment. Rainbow Dash still defending the pole position as she approaches the last two turns. As the top three drivers in this race enter lap three, seems like Fernando Alonso and Lewis Hamilton are struggling to keep up. Actually, I see Fernando Alonso in the distance. Looks like he's keeping up. But where is Lewis Hamilton? Another outstanding driving as they now enter the criminal street. Coming soon in the Forza 2020 Summer Fiesta, Lucas or Apple Derby returns. Beauty Bell, Scooty, and Apple Bill will compete to see who's the best and most traditional, creative, and fastest. But so 
again. 2020 Lucas or Applewood Derby will be announced very soon. Don't want to miss on that. Fernando Alonso rejoins the pack. Lewis Hamilton is nowhere to be seen. Sebastian Vettel and Connor are backing up the second. Vettel trying to defend the power passes and bring Sebastian down to third place. Fernando Alonso passes Sebastian Vettel at the beginning of Bohem. He went too wide on that turn but still manages to get back on track. Great driving. Connor tries to pass Rainbow Dash but all of a sudden, he loses it and gets off the track bringing him down to fourth place and Sebastian Vettel and Fernando Alonso regain back top three. Fernando Alonso and Sebastian Vettel chase down Rainbow Dash to make the loser lead as they now approach the black cement. Fabulous defense by Rainbow Dash, preventing Alonso from taking her position as they now enter turns 19 and 20. Drivers and here we go! White flag is out! With Rainbow Dash still leading this entire race. It's now up to Fernando Alonso, Sebastian Vettel, and Connor Ross to take her position. Rainbow Dash loses her pole position for the first time in this race. Fernando Alonso takes the lead as they tackle the old round. With Rainbow Dash desperate to win this race, Connor Ross gets up behind her hoping to take her down to third place. Seriously though? Where's Lewis Hamilton? I can see him keeping up with these drivers. Is he taking a jaw right? These drivers are putting out a great show here at Circuit de Sport Frankfurt Champs. Wonderful driving to them. There goes Fernando Alonso, Rainbow Dash who takes the lead and Connor Ross and Sebastian Vettel take second and third place once again. I must say, Sebastian Vettel is doing a really good job keeping up with Rainbow Dash. He did have trouble at Monza due to the fact that Fernando Alonso made contact with him on the last lap. Wonderful job coming through Poon. Connor's still not giving up on Rainbow Dash. This lap is getting intense. Here they come into the final stretch of my goodness. There was contact coming into Blackham and Sebastian Vettel and Fernando Alonso made contact with each other, bringing them off the track. Now it's up to Connor Ross to take them by Dash's position or secure second place, as they now approach the finish line. The two cross the line and Rainbow Dash wins this race. Great driving by the five-time equestrian motorsports champion. Let's take a look at the replay where Sebastian Vettel and Fernando Alonso made contact at the beginning of Black Cement. So it turns out that Fernando Alonso got too close to Sebastian Vettel, causing him to make wheel contact and spinning himself out of control as Sebastian Vettel saves his car from losing control. Good thing is that both Fernando and Sebastian were able to finish the race before Lewis Hamilton, therefore Sebastian Vettel takes third and Fernando takes fourth. Here are the results for today's race. In first place we got Rainbow Dash, Connor takes second, Sebastian Vettel takes third, Fernando Alonso finishes fourth, and Lewis Hamilton takes last place. And that concludes the last race for the opening of the Forza 2020 Summer Fiesta. Thank you so much for watching today's race. Up next, the 2020 Lucas Oil Applewood Derby.